Oh, hold my buns as I wish for day. This guy is in it. That is Lars Ulrich, drummer extraordinaire for Metallica. And shout out to Sven Smith 666 here on YouTube. I saw a YouTube short of him where he says that he saw them at the Download Festival, and they said the Metallica version, which is the one we're looking at right here on their official page, is not the same drum sounds that you heard at Download. And I says, this is very interesting. I wonder what that's, what, what that's all about. So that's what we're here to do. Uh, this is them in action. He does this uh, pop, 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 pop on the snare thing. It's... Uh -huh. Right there. But basically what uh, Sven was talking about is when it hits the brrr, bop, brrr, bop, this version from Metallica is much different than this version, this version, and this version. So we're going to listen to these versions. I've got it all set up. I'm very professional here. Got all of these set up around about the same spot. So let's check in, then we'll, we'll, we'll go back and forth. We'll see if you can hear a sound because you're going to have better ears than me and you're going to say, Shane, hi, I'm a professional recording engineer and I can explain to you what's going on here. Perhaps there's some tomfoolery, some trickery going on here, or perhaps there is not. That's what you're here to do is get in the comments below. Tell me what you think. Let's listen. This is uh, Glasto 1719's uh, uh, version of it. I don't remember it being like that, but... To me, it just sounds like the one single bass drum. Right here. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. And then we hear some stinky doodle there. There was a bit of stinky doodle there. You hear boop boop pa, boop boop pa, and then you hear boop, pa. Now here. He says, I'm gonna give it a go there. I'm gonna give it a go. Let's try this feller. This is uh, Tegan Bickmore, his version of it. I wonder what that snare thing is. I don't remember it being like that. Pa to pa, pa to pa, pa to pa, pa to pa. Speeding up on the timing too. Yeah, is it? Okay. Let's listen to this feller. This is uh, Robert O'Brien's version of it. <laughs> this used to be like a triumphant moment when they would hit that. See, and I don't know if it's just the, the emotion, is it's lifeless, you know, and the people are just kind of like, yeah, been there, done it, seen it, watched one, saw that the, a bunch, but now it's time. And this video will get dinged for the Metallica version of it, because if it gets dinged, it's because it's been recorded over.
Now, someone's going to say, oh, Shane, it's because um, you're getting a close-up of the microphone. So while the microphones are not coming through clearly, which I would say if the microphones are not coming cl through clearly for the audience, that's the most important people that they should be coming through. The guys that are connected to the Metallica uh, group here uh, should have a real good recording of it, but everyone outside should be hearing that. So here we go. That sounds flawless. That sounds 1988, baby. That sounds, that sounds tight as a whip. Tight as a whip. Lars. You know, there's a lot of arguments that could be made for, well, Shane, this is going up on their official YouTube and they want it to sound perfect. But if you're gonna make it sound perfect for that, then you should make it sound perfect for everybody else. All right, let's go back here, just one taste, one big taste and we're out of here. So what say you? Get down there and tell me what you think of that. He was not, Sven Smith 666 was not wrong, was he? They did a little bit of trickery to re-release this to, for the, for the now, now, don't get me wrong, folks. It sounds better. If you're going to go to the Metallica page and you're going to watch them from Castle Donington, England, June 10th, 2023, and you're going to watch them do the thing, then you want to hear a good version of it. But I'm just wondering, where was the disconnect? If you're going to do some, some, some uh, Wizard of Ozadry, uh, why don't you just do it so everybody else can hear it instead of just the raw? Here's what you're what you missed when you went to when you didn't go see Metallica. What say you? Get in the comments and tell me everything you know and love about it. Am I being overboard? Am I going overboard? There's going to be people that say Shane, you you're just going overboard with this. It sounded perfectly fine. Okay, so get down there and tell me what you think. Mm -hmm. Hold my breath as I wish. For death, oh please, God, wake me.